Hey guys, what's going on? This is United WWE and I can confirm that WWE 2K15 will have universe mode. Guys, this has been confirmed on GameStop.com as being leaked. Um, they put up a diagnosis of what will be in the game and they made reference to creation mode being in the game and universe mode. So it looks like we'll be able to create a superstar as we are every year and upload them online for others to download and universe mode will be making a return. But uh, guys, I'm just going to talk about Universe Mode because this is one of the, the modes in the recent WWE games that I really have not been impressed with. After usually you finish the whatever the career is in the game, last year it was 30 years of WrestleMania. After that, I usually turn to Universe Mode. Now, I have never actually done a full year of Universe Mode because I get bored of it so quick. I don't know about you guys, I've tried everything. I've read a lot of forums about how to make it more interesting, changing the rankings, turning rankings off, turning auto rivalries off, all that stuff, but uh, I've just never been able to string together a good universe mode, I just haven't enjoyed it, but one of the main reasons is mostly the matches repeat themselves every week, I'm not too sure how you change that in the rivalries, for instance I had Cody Rhodes versus Chris Jericho in a recent rivalry, and uh, for four weeks straight of Raw the same match just kept coming up and I just chose not to play them because what's the point if you're going to have a rivalry and they're going against each other every week on raw why not have a few cutscenes where they interrupt each other's matches um with the next gen i'm sure they could introduce stuff like the guy cutting a promo or something like, more advanced anyway than the, the normal cutscenes we've got of people attacking each other on the ramp when they're making their entrances just that boring crap but uh yeah i think this year i really hope there's a few game modes because if there is to be a, a main career mode where it, whatever it is if it's a legends mode nxt mode after that guys i'm talking about after you finish the main phase of the game you need something to stay interested in the game because i don't think playing online is that much to keep you interested in the game and universe mode that you need something else like when smackdown vs raw 2007 came out you had the career mode it was absolutely fantastic it kept you going for a long time but uh, the gm mode kept you glued to the game as well i absolutely love gm mode i'd probably still play it today actually i might start making videos on gm mode i absolutely loved uh, taking part in gm mode it was absolutely fantastic it, it kept you wanting to come back and play more of the game but i really don't have that lately with the wwe games uh maybe you play for about two months max when it comes out and then i just use the game to make videos and commentaries on but uh i wouldn't say i like compared to other games i play fifa i probably play that a lot more because it's a lot more to it it's a lot more interesting a lot more stake i think if they introduce something like that in wwe where like i think it's it comes in line with the the product at the moment there's no real urgency about it uh, you could probably skip a few weeks of universe mode and you'd miss nothing just like you'd miss nothing if you skip raw for a few weeks but uh yeah guys leave your comments down below what kind of modes would you like to see in wwe 2k15 there's been a lot of talk of nxt mode wcw mode and a lot of them have been shot down and a lot of speculation going around at the moment guys so i want you to leave your comments down below what kind of modes would you like to see in wwe 2k15 me personally uh i probably won't be playing universe mode in wwe 2k15 unless there's some major improvements which i don't think we'll see I'm not too sure about that but hopefully i've read there will be a lot of new modes so hopefully the likes of gm mode nxt mode something like that does to keep us going in the game and not to you know not to drop that controller too early keep us interested in the game because i think that's been one of the main major problems for wwe games in recent times so thank you very much for watching guys leave your comments and opinions down below subscribe for more wwe 2k15 news and peace